Hey guys, how's everyone? Kevin the Rocket here, and uh, this uh, tonight I'm not actually gonna do a review or anything. I might do one later, but uh, right now I'm just going to go over some things with you. Uh, people ask me what is the best free antivirus. Now, out of these from Download.com, where I get most of my software from, uh, from the Security Center they have. The most downloads is AVG Internet Security Free Edition 2011. Um, I personally do not think that is the best antivirus. I mean, the detection rates are good, but the RAM usage and memory usage is uh, huge, um, very big, and yeah. So, uh, well, they've—I mean, they've improved—they've improved for a while because uh, before whenever I used to use our software I didn't like it that much but right here as you can see we get an antivirus, anti-spyware, link scanner, residence shield, uh, email scanner, update manager, PC analyzer, anti-root kit, license, and identity protection all for the free edition and it shows right here the installer is 4.41 megabytes but that's not really true because it's not that small once you download that it's going to self extract and it extracts everything and then it will download more whenever you start installing here's the specifications um, it's from AVG it was released December 29, 2010 um, there's their website security software okay the operating systems are Windows 7 Vista or XP if you have 95, 98 or you need to update um, right here 4.41 megabytes as I said this is the file name and as you can see the popularity 340 million 303,435 downloads in all uh, downloads last week was 1,644,507 and as you can see license model is free now they do have um, if you go to their website and they have an internet security let's see let's just look at the internet security how much it would be for one year subscription, it would be uh, $54 for one computer. For two years subscription, $81. If you have just say two computers, as you can see, $64.99 for one year and $96.99 for two years. You'll see you 10 computers for a business or something. $299 for two years and one year is $199. Um, you get a lot more protection with the internet security version uh, so yeah okay so let's go to Avast now as you can see it had 1,009,428 um, downloads from last week uh, I personally actually used Avast before I did not find it bad uh, it's whenever I tested it before, it missed maybe a few things, but I'm gonna I think I might do a next test on this or something like that. I'll have to see, talk it over with my partner and see what we're gonna do. Um, but yeah, this one's second in popularity ranking. Um, as you can see, you get real time shields, and I mean, there's like a lot of shields you get for this um, mail shield, P2P shield. Um, there's just a whole list of them. Mail shield, uh, file shield, web shield, web guard, all that kind of stuff. Like I said, I personally use this. I do not find it bad in any way. As you can see, whenever you register, you get a one year. Um, so, yeah. And the specifications for this are. Okay, so here we go, Vast Software. Here's their website. This was released January 20th. Once you download all these products too, you will have to update them. 
Um, another tip, don't run two antivirus softwares at one time. Just say don't run AVG and Avast at the same time because they can conflict and have problems. And yeah, so don't do that. Um, antivirus software. So yeah, this one's compatible with Windows 7, Windows 2000. This one was not compatible with. Um, one sec. All right, sorry about that. Um, this one's compatible with Windows 2000, um, Windows Vista, and XP and Seven. This one is a bigger installer, five or fifty-six point eleven megabytes. I personally like the bigger installers like this, not like the AVG that you just have to download and extract it all, because that seems to take longer. I like this better. Now the total downloads were one hundred twenty-five thousand or one hundred twenty-five million. 709,670 uh, 709,670 um, as you can see last week 1,909,428 and license model is free okay so what's new in this version version 5.1.889 includes the following updates I hate you I never come out of just randomly start scanning sorry about that boot time scanner now available in even in 64 windows um, so yeah boot time scanner that's a good um, function or feature I should say and a vast uh, big improvements to the in the behavior shield big improvements to or improvements to the anti rootkit engine improvements to the cleaning module st uh, stability performance improves improvements of the web shield community IQ improvements added support for sound packs um, minor improvements in the in user interface so they might have added some features in there so let's just take a look and see how much their vast internet security would cost products let's see Okay, so it, their internet security is $59. That is not good for all you, or then that is not bad for what you all get. And I believe that's for one year. You get continuous protection against viruses and spyware, ensures your all mails sent and received are clean. Um, keeps your keeps you protected from chat infections. So if you're in a chat room or if you're using MSN, somebody tries to send you an infected file, it'll stop you there. Uh, stops attacks from hijacked websites, uh, which means it can hijack your computer and redirect you to another site. Blocks hacker attempts to protect your identity so you don't enter your identity on a fake antivirus website or anything they're selling you that is fake. Um, keeps your mailbox free from spam. Allows safe and uninterrupted gaming. That's also a feature for the free edition also. You just have to right click or open up the interface and click enable gaming version or gaming uh, mode I think it is and it'll keep all the CPU and stuff to the main. So now the okay malware bytes that's a good anti-malware it's not you can buy it for I think it's like 20 bucks or 30 bucks or something like that for the full edition and it will run all the time if you want it to run all the time. Um, so we'll just take a look at this but this is like good for scanning like once a week or once a month or whatever you feel like doing it's got uh, quick scan full scan flash scan protection update quarantine logs ignore list settings more tools and about I personally use this on my own computer um, I really don't even scan that much because I don't um, good to bad websites or anything like that with viruses on them because I know whenever there's a virus somewhere not to go there um, so yeah then this one has 58 million nine hundred and eighty thousand eight hundred nine total downloads 529,834 downloads this, uh, this week number one in spyware removals and you can download this and it will remove spyware that's already on your computer or adware or trojans or anything like that. 
if you check out my removal video for malware or anything like that, you can see the best way to remove malware. So this one is compatible with Windows 7, Windows 2003, Windows 2000, Windows XP, Windows Vista, Windows Server 2008. Uh, 700 or 7.38 megabytes for the size. It's free and limitations for the free. Real-time protection is enabled or disabled, sorry. But yeah, it's 25 bucks. Um, I wouldn't even really wor uh, worry about paying the 20 bucks because I would not use this as a real-time scanner. I mean, it's good and all, but I would rather use something more advanced that has a firewall and stuff like that. And third or fourth, I'm sh going to check out or tell you about Avira. Okay, Avira is f uh, 56.58 megabytes of download. Um, it is free. Um, I haven't personally used this, but I did some tests on it. It did all right. Um, and if you go to download.com or cnet.com, and you can play these little videos. cnet.com slash live is the place all about to find this, your uh, favorite scene certain antivirus or whatever it is, that's just an advertisement, don't worry about that. Um, but yeah, this is not a bad antivirus, it has 116,427,451 downloads. Now I believe these are not, one second, top downloads. Check this out. Okay, here we go, as you can see, Adware is the most downloaded. Now I hear a lot about this. I never personally use it. I'll have to test it one time, but I'm not worried about that right now because that's just Adware or Adware, I guess. So, okay, so ABG comes in second. Third is, or I mean, yeah, third is Avast, and fourth is Avira. So back to Avira. The specifications are security software. It's compatible with Windows 7, Windows Vista 32-bit, Windows XP 64-bit, Windows Vista 64-bit, Windows XP 32-bit. Okay, so as you can see, 116,427,451 total downloads, um, 429,332 downloads last week. Um, so yeah, as you can see, it's free, no limitations, no price. There's a um, version you can buy. Let's see how much that is. For home free premium let's just check out the security suite okay for one year one PC it's fifty one dollars and ninety three cents just say three years one PC seventy eight dollars so let's just say one year three or one PC three years hundred and three dollars and eighty six cents uh, I think that's kind of outrageous but as you can see you get uh, stops all type of viruses that's not really true because if the definitions don't catch it or they're not updated in time, then that piece of malware is going to get through. But anti ad, anti spyware, anti phishing, anti rootkit, anti drive by, mail, mail guard, web guard, rescue system, create a bootable rescue CD. This is a very good thing. I've always heard good about it. I never did it before, but yeah, I heard it's very good. Quick removal, netbook support. Ahead technology, parental control, game mode, firewall, anti spam, backup system, anti bot, and Avira support, express installation, generic report, anti active pro, anti vera, uh, proactive. So, so yeah, those are the top three free antiviruses on download.com. Now my personal antivirus that I use is Komodo Internet Security Premium. Um, 
it is free. It comes with Defense Plus, which is a sandbox. It comes with Antivirus, and it also comes with a Firewall. Now these products that it comes with are very good. I like all of them because if it misses one thing, then it will catch the other thing. But as you can see, Home and Office, if you go here, Internet Security, and right here, 100% free. You get antivirus, anti spyware, anti rootkit, and bot protection. Defends your PC from internet attacks, detects and eliminates viruses, prevents malware from being installed. Auto sandbox technology, which is Defense Plus, easy to install, configure, and use for both. Free to both business and home users. 60 days of free Geek Buddy live remote PC support. So if you get viruses and you don't know how to remove them, then you can use their Geek Buddy and get them out. As you can see, features, um, there's a list, I guess I'll just go through them. Default, deny, uh, protection, prevention, based protection, um, auto sandboxing, defense plus there, personalized uh, protection alerts, uh, spyware scanning, cloud-based antivirus, cloud-based behavior denial analysis, cloud-based whitelisting, malicious website filtering, game mode, application control, one-click virus scanning, uncluttered user-friendly interface through interface wizards, um, geek body 60 days free through, yeah, so, okay. Um, it is compatible with Windows 7, Vista, XP, Service Pack 2 for XP, unless it's for all of them. Free Pro Trial. You want to get the free download here. And then you want to select your 64-bit or 32-bit. Um, it is, this is the system requirements, 350 megabytes on your hard disk, 128 megabytes of RAM, and 32-bit or 64-bit operating systems. Um, it's 31 megabytes to install. Here, I'll just show you really fast that. Let me find it. Okay, so as you can see, Komodo is right here. I see 3 megs there, 2 megs there, 5 megs. That is not bad at all, 6 megs. So I start up the internet and we'll see what it goes to. Okay, so now it went up to 9 megs. That's still very good. Oh, wait, what's this? Unless this is part of it too, I'm not really sure. But, yeah, it's very good. Um, so, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. It might have been boring for you, but it's my best advice to you guys. Um, if you have any questions, please feel free to comment um, or send me a private message. And I almost forgot. A second. partner back I forget how to pronounce it already you told me in the afternoon but I already forgot A C A F A C A A one if you go to my channel and you see check them out and have our softwares by him so he's very very helpful just as long as or just as I am so if you guys need any help just comment rate or subscribe or if you need any help comment and send a private message to me or him he'll be happy to help you also um, so yeah we're gonna be working together for a while so I guess that's it please comment rate and subscribe and I'll catch you guys later